All right, well, got another new panel to demonstrate. whoop de do. It's a Fireland MP12. Some of you may remember I had one of these a couple of years ago. I've since sold it, and uh, now I've got another one. So, it's an older one, of course, as you can tell by the, the front. It's also been uh, weathered. As you can see, it's more of an orange color than it is red, like it usually is out of the box. But anyways, it's an MP12, 12 volt, um, two zones, and uh, came with this relay card here as well, which is pretty cool. Got a couple troubles on here. Um, one being battery in the second, you'll see the AC power light is flashing. That's indicating a brownout. So I believe the transformer is on its way out, but um, I'm not too sure. The panel works otherwise, but um, yeah, that's just kind of annoying. Um, so yeah, that's the, uh, the panel. It's very basic. Um, as many of you know, I had one of these, like I said, a couple years ago for uh, demo systems. And uh, now I've got another one. So yeah, got a 4250-120 here. Okay, this is zone one because uh, 4250-120s are the only acceptable option. And then for horn strobes, I have a GX90S rebranded by Simplex with a Faraday strobe on it. Pretty rare to kind of match that. And then I've got a P2RL as the um, retrofit, if you will. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get to it. man they, they hit the ear pretty hard um so we'll go ahead and reset 4251 and um one thing that i did with the old panel that you can do is if you hit the disable button while it's still an alarm you can actually turn the horns back on like that so yeah and here's the trouble so yeah Reset, close this sucker up, and uh, that's the MP12. I'll try to get this on a demo board, along with another firelight panel I've got. And um, yeah, look forward to more videos.